it to make things even more interesting. For example, this trader sells uh, flour for two gold, <laughs> and the other one buys them for free. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> would you like to make some money? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Furtherest Frontier. I'm in the and man. <laughs> Let's become rich. Insanely rich. Lots and lots of money. That's the plan for today, ladies and gentlemen, because right now I have around 145 gold. I am not making any additional money because of the... Uh, I, only, I only have one single market. The services and my soldier training currently eat all of my income. So we need to gain money in different ways. We need to get money in order to build skulls. We need money to get some parks. We need a bunch of shit. But all of that requires money. And also want to put foundations for the for the upcoming episodes uh, because eventually I would like to expand the city uh, to that, get that shit to work. I basically need to make a proper decision when it comes to the layouts. Different layouts offers you different uh, information about the, the current map. So for example, if I'm gonna actually change to layout, I think it was G? No, it was F, I think. Yeah, fertility. There we go. So I got the fertility layout, which basically indicates how much fertility you have on the ground. So, for example, this area over here is very good for farmlands, right? Uh, this one over here is not so good, so we could try to expand the city over here, over those bushes, uh, to get it closer to this fertile land over here. We have some more fertile land over here if I really want to. Uh, there is apparently lots of fertile land over here, so maybe actually building a city around this thing would be a good idea. We will see. Uh, second thing is that water. So your houses will require water. So from the looks of it, this territory over here is actually very good to make housing area, right? We got we got water over here, which means I could try to build wells. And the fertility of the land is not good enough for me to, to even bother building farms over here. Like farms over here. What? I'm able to find sp space for the sauce. I don't know what you mean. Honestly. Like what the shit. Also, uh, I think I... I didn't allow... Yeah, I didn't allow any food to be stored in the warehouse. So the food should now go to the, to the granary, I hope. We'll see about that thing. Also, I want to make some more fields over here. So that's gonna be the things we're gonna try to focus on. This building search is full. So then fucking empty it? We have 450 meat over here. Okay, put it to the smokehouse. Store buildings. Why are you showing me this? Rot seller, see, I know, it's good for starting food items, keep them fresh for much longer. Yeah, that's why I have the granary, right? You have the granary to keep, uh, to keep, to keep the, the food safe. I don't understand the shit. I really don't. Maybe it's a little access. I don't know. I don't know, man. Right, so, uh, we need to have fields over here. Also, I want to have another hunter. Because apparently right now I have no other means of defending my my uh, my village. But the hunters are apparently a great help. So, we have two hunters at the moment. I would like to have the fourth one. I think I'm gonna actually build you over here. Let's see. Hunter cabin. There we go. Uh, let's rotate you and build you like this. Sweet! Awesome. Very good. Get that shit to build. What? Food loss to spoilage, to tallow. Tallow? Tallow can spoil? Uh, okay, so then don't keep it over there, I guess? I don't know. Okay, anything else we need to worry about? Yeah, well, income. Wait, what? I'm making six income. How the... What? How we are making six income? Uh, hold on, what? Soldier training, minus 10. Why is that? What exactly is happening over here? Guard, garnison, age 18. You don't look 18. All of a sudden, I'm making income. I don't understand why. Multi cost, 5. Only cost five. Was it was ten? Why it got lowered by by a half? I mean, sure, more money for me. I don't fucking care. Fertility over here is through the roof. 
I really, really would like to have some some proper crop fields over here. Uh, so leave one tile over here to make a f m uh, make a fence. How big you want this field to be? Uh, eleven by. Maybe I can make it six by six. I think that would be actually a good idea. So if I'm gonna go here. No, 6 by 12. How about that? So workers... Yeah, it's it's just on the on the border, I guess. Because if I'm gonna extend it by a tile, then it's gonna increase the worker amount to 3. So keep it, keep it on this. And same one over here. So it's gonna be something like this. And 6 tiles here. Probably just, bef just in front of the berry bushes that I would like to keep around. Haha! <laughs> Everything goes according to plan, what I can say. It was all a strategic matter, boys. Everything was planned. Now it's everything going according to plan. That's exactly how I do my shit. That's how the syndicate rolls. Make a gate over here. Uh, we need another gate on the opposite side. Uh, okay, sure, like, why not? Build it like this. Okay, now we just have to add some fences and it's gonna be golden. No, not this. The fence. Thank you. Fence over here. Goes over here. And be sure that you're gonna connect it to this gate here on the opposite side of the fields. Beautiful. Sweet! And of course, just a road to make it final. Nice! Okay, fields are ready. Uh, hopefully the, the, the deals will be pushed out. So you'll see about that thing. Why the fuck I have so little food? Food lost to spoilage. Why I'm losing food to spoilage? Can somebody please explain this shit to me? Why is the granny not working? New villager uh, immigrated. Okay, good. What? You don't have water? Doesn't have access to clean water source. Build a well nearby. That's gonna be a bit of a problem. Tannery. That's gonna be a bit of a problem. Unless... Let's see. Where's the button? I could try to build you a well, I think, over here. How's the fertility? Uh, acceptable, I guess. Villagers are unable to con construct more storehouses to provide additional storage for those items. Why I have a feeling that this constantly applies to the to the food? Why? The, the granite is not what. Oh. Oh. An above ground structure for the storage of wheat and other grains. Hold on. Underground structure used to store food. Ah, I see. I've made a. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ah, shit. I made. I, I've made. I've, I've made a goof. I made a goof. I've literally have no place to store my food. <laughs> Good job, you! Shut up! Some of the issues solved, some of the issues appear. I'm gonna build them a well over here so the tannery can continue work because we need to, uh, we need to get high codes uh, for trading. Also, I should have some flux around here, I think. Let's see, resources. Yeah, we got 249 flux. So, with that thing, I could make the weaver. The weaver. And this, this should provide me with some type of income. So if I'll just slap this shit here and hope that my bastards will actually build this thing, then hopefully I'll be able to make some, some additional uh, items for trading. Because right now this is the only means for me to acquire money. I need money. You guys have a spare change? Any of you? We don't pay taxes. Yeah, well, how? I think you're about to start to pay taxes. You lazy assholes! Ah, great! My fisherman cannot comprehend the concept of a wall! I don't know, do you live in a supermarket? Your door constantly goes up and off, up and off, open and closed, open and closed. Yeah, that's that's why a concept of a, of a wall is just beyond you. Right, you live under the tree! Ah, uh, fine. Game? Yeah, that, that, they, have, they, have, they, they have problems with a, with a wall. Concept of wall is way too much for them. Okay, how about this? I will destroy this just for you. And this one over here as well. You assholes better get to, to work. L you better start to do something. Otherwise, you have not seen yet me pissed. 
Trust me, other games, villagers in other games, have already seen me crazy. Do you want to see me crazy? No, you don't. You really don't. Um, sire, the field is cold. Put a warm blanket over it. I don't care. Uh, okay, the well is under construction. Ah, apparently those fuckers found buckets of water, apparently, recently. So that's great. Uh, we need more... We need more planks for trading. Planks, planks at the moment are gonna be my main source of trading. So, reserve 80 planks for this structure here. And put less of the planks into the trading outpost. So, remaining, actually make it on 65. I think the, I think the sub will be able to make more in the upcoming days. We just need to deliver them some more wood and they're gonna be fine. And we got a bunch of wood over here. Uh, since I have to clear the place for, for the fields. Can somebody please tell Wolfie to shut the fuck up? He's annoying! Ah, but regardless, all of this thing closer to the man. I am very, very grateful for the devs, for the opportunity to play this game. It's just... I, I like it way more than you think. I honestly do. Everything about this game is so chilling. The music is awesome, the visuals are just magnifique, as they say, in Southern Africa. Uh... It's actually it's uh, European Africa, but okay, whatever. Uh, it, it's, it's just the only thing, the only thing I would like to have is a possibility to build a settlement next to a sea. I would like to build a harbor. That's the only thing I need. And maybe if the devs would be very kind, give the option to build like uh, like a fortress, you know, like a monument. Or oh, monuments would be cool. I would like to see monuments. Okay, castle. Cathedral. I don't know what those suckers believe in. Like, for me, you can believe in the magical fucking fairy tree. I don't give a shit. I want to build you a monument. Right? So, monuments, uh, harbor areas, uh, fortresses, stuff like that. That, that, that. That's something I would dig. I would dig it without, like, a question. Also, plant the trees. Because we need more trees, sire. Yeah, I know. Shut up. This is the way you make you, 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 you make money in this game. You invest one coin, they plant a tree, the tree grows instantly, you chop down the tree, you have four logs, you put the four logs into the sour mill, the sour mill gives you four planks and you sell them for 12 gold. What I can say, the game encourages trading. I just added a bit of a cheese to the trade. Speaking of the cheese, the fucking bandit stole cheese last time from me. I will have my vengeance, one way or another. Look at the scaffolding! Yay! We'll just succumb to illness. Do I look like somebody who cares? I mean, one board every minute. We have 50 more to, to go. <laughs> Tell the Reaper that he's gonna be busy. Still have to go to the, the fields. Fertility 71. Fertility 73. I don't care about that shit. Uh, hold on, slow down the game maybe a little bit. Okay, this field is regaining his fertility, so I don't really care what they're gonna do here. Actually, I can remove one of those. Not this. And add... Not this, this. Oh, I cannot add you. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, then don't add you. Don't, don't add. Uh, yeah, I don't think we need this many uh, of those workers. So, if I could remove one, move you here, remove this one, and add this, so we're gonna gain more fertility. That should be fine. How exactly I should... I, I, we need to spread this thing a little bit better, you know? Hold on, pause the game, pause the game for like a second. Uh, delete all of this. De 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 delete, Cle clear it completely. Clear, 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 clear. Okay, so, fertility. Uh, I need to add some clay apparently to the... To the that won't give me anything, but let's give it a try. Uh, fertility 68. Fertility six, uh, 69. Fertility minus 40. I don't understand this thing. Total yield. Fertility minus 32. Ah! Wait, 
How the fuck does the clover reduce his fertility? The job of the clover is to increase fertility. See, it's in the description. Can be grown to replenish soil fertility in a field. I don't make any food out of this shit. It's, its sole purpose is to uh, increase the fertility of the field. Impact on yield. Minus... Ooh, that's a lot actually. Huh. Well, I have to fix... Hmm. We have to fix more fields, I guess. Right? So right now, this, this field over here is getting fixed. So let's remove those things. So this field is getting fixed, right? Uh, I'm gonna do something like this. Add those. Add those. One. Okay, we can go with this shit, I guess. Uh, so that field is currently getting uh, rejuvenated. Uh, what about you? 5065. Yeah, we need additional fields. Like those, those fields over here have to be activated if the, for this thing to work. Uh, remove, 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 remove. Soul mixture for clover. Oh. No soul uh, selected. Huh. Okay, I wonder how that thing is actually gonna work. grow. So. We need food, right? Uh, expected yield. 400 and something. Okay, good. What about this one? 224. Okay. So... Frost tolerance. Heat tolerance. Ah, but this one has better heat tolerance. Ah, I see. That's how it goes. Uh, 200 also, but you have great frost tolerance, just as this thing. But this one also has heat tolerance. Growth rate is 81. Growth time is 92. Impact fertility. Oh, this one is minus. And this one is plus? I see. I think they've changed some things since the last recording. What about this one? Fertility minus two. Fertility minus two. Uh, no, fertility minus five. Fertility minus two. Minus two. Minus three. Minus four. Fertility impact plus five. Okay. So, for some no reason to me, the peas also increase fertility. Okay, that gives me an interesting idea. I've changed it a little bit how the fields are gonna work. So we'll see the outcome in the in the upcoming years. It's all about, you know, learning, experimenting. There is a dead corpse in the city! Oh wait, can I remove graveyards? Ah, still no option. Uh, if you don't know, I've made this graveyard over here by mistake and I want to remove it and build it actually outside of the village, but the game was, won't allow me to do so. So that's great. Yeah, good job, Neo. Shut up. Okay, uh, what else? Well, I've ordered them to finish this thing a little bit faster, if that's a possibility. Wait, how much? Ah, okay, so the smoker is actually keeping up with the demand. So that's nothing we can do. Same goes for the fish, I guess. Yeah. Okay, how about... How you guys are doing? You're doing great. So, I was thinking what uh, we could try to do to get more money. Apparently, building more houses won't give me give me anything since all of my income comes from the market. See? Monthly income 20. Uh, taxes only comes from markets and it's 20. So, this is like the only income I have right now. And building more markets? That's, that's not gonna work. Okay, what we need to do is we need to upgrade the market. So to upgrade the market, I require bricks. So I was checking last time this shit. If you don't know, and I call this thing bullshit. To get bricks, we need to get to tier 3. Uh, what's the brick maker? Uh, Brickyard, there it is. This thing produces bricks. Okay, it's on tier 3. So I have to upgrade my town center to tier 3. There's a bit of a problem. To upgrade my town hall to tier 3, I need to have a school, which, are, which, is, which is a quest on its own, because this thing requires, like, a lot of, a lot of fucking resources. Uh, I need to have homesteads. I have none. I have no idea what this shit is. I need to have 125 people. 125 people! I have 51! Five in the graveyard, included. 
So that's that's a bit of a problem. Uh, so th those are gonna be the things we have to focus on. Uh, I just see that the trader has arrived, so that's good. Okay, please tell me that you can buy. I can sell you bricks. I want to buy bricks. 19 gold for bricks. Nice. Oh, you're actually buying cleaning cloths. Too bad my tailor is still not ready. Uh, what else? You buy cows. Uh, sorry, you sell cows for 700. 700 for a cow? A single cow? Christ! Okay, what else stupid fucking uh, trade offers you have, huh? You are the worst trader. I don't want to make any business with you. Fuck off. The gate is that way. Actually, we got four gates. You can pick one. And get the hell out of here. Another trader has arrived. Good thing that you can actually have two traders at a time. I don't know. Is this a bug? Or how the game is supposed to work? I hope this is not a bug. And actually, they're gonna keep it as it is. Uh, okay, we can buy fish from you for a very good price. Uh, what you selling? What you buying? You're selling iron ore. Okay, you buying cleaning clothing, and I also cannot make that. God damn it! You buying candles, pottery, coal. You are selling armor for quite the price. Okay, th those we won't be able to make money on those traders. That's for sure. Uh, I would like to buy some uh, fish from you. Buy and transfer. Thank you. Thank you, going good, good, good business with you, sir. Good, good business, good business. Come again, come again, but with lower prices. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Okay, one of the traders is leaving, so that's okay. Nobody cares about him. Uh, chop down those trees. Defenses around the fields are almost ready. The fields will require another four years of plowing, apparently. <laughs> uh, that's gonna take some time. How's the fertility? Ah, great, we got sickness on the fucking uh, field. Fertility 59. Okay, this one is getting repaired. Fertility 66. 76. Okay. This is this is growing quite nicely. Willow bush. Oh, that's nice. We need those things for the baskets. How how do I collect willow bush? How do I collect you? Uh Willow bushes produce flexible stacks and can be collected by foragers. By foragers. Shit, they already got. They already got a bunch of things to do. Ah, uh, I cannot spare any more foragers. Okay, uh, I'll try to. Get over here and collect this thing for me, please. Look at this. This is this is like highest priority. Prioritize. Get this shit! The market all of a sudden is making more taxes. How come? Market also generated tax revenue and increased the durability of surrounding houses. How does the the market the market? I think the developers fixed this thing. I think that the more houses now we have around the market, the more money he he makes for you. That's the only explanation that I have. Barn. Uh, yeah, cattle can be stored here. The thing is, a cattle cost me seven hundred. I don't have this type of a money right now. Yeah, it disappears, see? When I was playing this thing last time, the market had like a flat income of 20 gold. Now this thing have disappeared from the, from here. Monthly cost, rat catcher. I think the rat catcher also monthly cost have been reduced. Healer's house, that's that not has that has not been reduced. Uh wait, you know what? Can we actually build a school? 100 coins. Okay, for now, keep it. I need the cash. I need the cash. Till I won't find a good trade offer, we need the cash. At least my food storage is, is growing. So that's great. Where the fuck are you going? Hey! What is this thing? Rebels? <laughs> what? Oh. You're, like, you're collecting nuts. Wait, all three people are going outside to collect some nuts? I don't know, it's crazy. What the shit? And now we are making baskets. Finally, so to my understanding the baskets will go to the villagers and that should give them uh, Bigger pockets so they can carry more like they can carry more clothing they can carry more berries They can carry more. I don't know mushrooms. Uh, they can carry more logs. Yeah, you know, that's That's understandable. You can squeeze a log 
one log in your left pocket, one log in your right pocket, one log maybe in the shoe. Uh, second log, let's say, is gonna go into the basket. Maybe two, because there's a basket, so obviously it's gonna fit more. And then uh, one log attached to your forehead. Duh! You don't know how those things work in medieval times? Tch, <laughs> weaklings. New trader has arrived, and he is buying logs. I mean, planks. Where the fuck are the planks? Ah, inventory. Okay, 99. Uh, pff, the price is terrible. I don't want to sell it for this price. You sell clay, you sell, sell bricks. I don't have money to buy bricks. That's a nice uh, price for beans, actually. Uh, I can try to sell you some shoes. Yeah, let's let's give you some shoes. And by some, I mean like around 50. Come on, give it to me. Time to make a deal. So 51 uh, shoes for 14 gold each. That's 714 gold. Thank you very much. Okay, we get, we've made some money. Can I buy something from you that could benefit me potentially? Yeah, well, the brick, the bricks, the, the bricks have a terrible price right now. Uh, buying clay won't give me anything. Uh, do I need food? I don't need that much food, but I'm gonna buy some just just to make good trade relations with the neighbors. Like for sixty something, seventy, whatever. Buy and transfer. Thank you. Let's wait for the other trader. I think our trader will also arrive. Right, since last time we have two traders, so I don't see the reason why there should be no no two traders this time. Uh, I've sent scouts around to look for resources, but I'm not finding anything interesting. Just some more clay maybe here and there, but nothing else. Okay, field is ready. Took you guys with us time, don't you? Uh, how's the fertility? Oh my god, with level 85%. Ah, that's awesome. Get one guy here, and this is what you're gonna do. Oh, okay, that, that doesn't work. Hold on. There we go. Next year, this. Next year, this. Actually, hold on. Move this. Okay, good. That works. Uh, where's the other trader? Hello! Mr. Trader! I need to make some money out of your pocket. Preferably. Hmm. Nobody wants to show it up in my beautiful city. Right, this sighted and building some fire. Why the? Oh, that's not good. Just next to the to the tower that they decided not to finish. Yay! Get the hunters here. All of them. Get into the walls quickly. Move it, hunters. You are my only fo form of defense right now. Uh, hunter cabin. Wait, that's a that's a Fletcher. Can the f no the Fletchers cannot fight. Get the hunters over here, pronto. Every single fucking ass hunter that we have, move to the middle of the village. Go 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 go. Oh, the wall is melting. Wait, you're out of arrows. Hey 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 hey, what the fuck are you doing? Fire with the bow. Oh Jesus. Where the fuck is your arrow? Hmm. Okay, that's that's not working. No, not the town center. Wait, can can the town center help me somehow? Guys and villagers, what exactly is this thing is gonna give me? Let's find out, shall we? Fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back. Everybody, fall back. Uh. Ah, good. You are actually fighting from the town center. How nice. Kill them all! <laughs> oh, that's a nice shot! He's dead! No, you run! You run! You run! Run to the tower! Run to the tower! Tower! Fire! Uh, anyone else? Yay! Blink is another attack. Uh, Blink attacked. Okay. I don't think they've managed to, to steal anything this time. That's for my cheese, you assholes! Build a new school to set this town apart from other small villages. A school will help train more efficient workers and attract more educated settlers. You want to buy? F uh, you want to pay for the construction? Because I mean, I can afford it right now. Should I? Should I? Also, uh, the houses should upgrade themselves, I guess. 
No, I don't have this ability yet. Shit. Right, you want a school? 25 uh, clay. Mm, ah, fuck it, build it over here. What's the worst that could possibly happen, right? Can I make like a nice road around this thing? Something? I mean, the, 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 I like that you don't have to actually go, you know, square by square. You can actually go a little bit crazy with the road and stuff. Uh, sure, let's give you over here. And also, I want to make some decorations around here. Let's see, small garden, shrub, small plaza. Okay, that sounds nice. Uh, let's actually give you here. And I want one here, one here, one here, one here. Let's decorate this place, shall we? And what else? Yeah, let's, let's make some shrubbery. Oh yeah! It's gonna be the best village to live in. I fucked up. Uh, small garden. Fun. That's not the thing I want. Why the game did you change that? Small park. D you call that thing a small park? This is an interesting uh, thing. This guy is selling soap for uh, for nine coins. This is far below average. You know what? I'm gonna risk it. Why not? I have 600 gold in my pocket. So... 70, 70 soap. I'll try to buy. Buy it and stock it. And hopefully when the next trader is gonna arrive, he's actually will be willing to either buy soap from me or he's gonna buy planks. I have stored 200 planks over here. How much do I have any shoes I can try to store? Crossbows. I can set him crossbows, huh? Okay. Uh, what is the shoes? I got 45 shoes in the settlement's uh, inventory. You have hides, but you sell them actually overpriced. I don't want to buy those. I got... Hide coats. We can we can transfer some of those. Let's say around thirty or so. Uh, okay. What about linen clothing? Ah, I have none. What the heck you guys are doing with the linen clothing, huh? Wait. You know what? I'm gonna put actually more people over here. There you go. How much how much flux I have? I have none. That would explain why those guys are slacking around. I see. New trader has arrived. Let's see. Trader number two. Come on. Uh, you are not buying any of the things I would like to sell. Shit! My g my brilliant plan to make money is not going according to plan. Uh, fuck. Shit! Wait, you are oh fuck, you're buying beer. Uh, what I could try to buy from you? You sell shoes for ten. Do you buy shoes by any chance, maybe? Nope. God damn it. In order to collect clay, which is this thing here, uh, requires town center tier 2 and a wagon shop. So the wagon shop is in the storage section. There it is. Workshop that trans would transport wagons are manufactured. Wagons can be used by villagers to quickly transport goods from one place to another. I see. Uh, can I build one over here? Yeah, build, build one over here, and we're gonna make like some nice uh, decorative roads and stuff. Beautiful. And uh, let's 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 plant a tree or two. Why not? Who's gonna stop me? But sire, if the trees will catch fire, then the town will burn. <laughs> I hope so. Hey, this trader wants to buy my soap. Wow, we're gonna make some money, hopefully. Uh, gold. You would like to buy gold ore? Too bad I don't have any gold ore. Uh, what else we have? Stone... Yeah... Okay. I'll wait for the other trader, hopefully. But I think we're gonna make some money out of the... Out of this, right? If I'll sell... No, uh, no, 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 not this thing. I want to sell... Uh, what can I sell you? Yeah, we're gonna make some money out of it. <laughs> money! Gold! Coins! The other trader has also arrived, so... Yeah, you buy You buy this for a nice price you buy shoes for a nice price No, you sell mm, that that doesn't work uh, Okay, can I cheese the game somehow? I don't think so 
What? I could try to sell to one and buy from the other. What? I could try to sell from one and buy from the other. What about, what about weaponry? Do you buy weaponry? Uh, no. What about iron? Do you buy iron? You buy iron ore. What about iron bars? You don't buy iron bars? Do you sell iron bars by any chance? No, you don't. God damn it. The game is working against me. What the shit? I've sold all the soap. Uh, can't buy anything from them to, to like, make, make some additional money, so... Whatever game. Uh, iron mine has been locked. Gold mine has been locked. Coal mine has been locked. Sand pit has been locked. That's very nice. Work camp. Uh, pottery building. Weaver. We already got a weaver. Candle shop. I could try to maybe make some candles. Soap shop. Tallow. Wait, do I make tallow out of hunting? I, technically speaking, I do. Wait, do, how much tallow do I have? 260, 284. 284. And I have herbs. I could try to make some soap. Finally managed to put myself a school. Yay! And nobody wants to work here. I wonder why. I have villagers left. Teacher. Education required... Oh, I need somebody who is actually educated to work here. Oh, okay. So, do we have an educated villager somewhere here that's like working in a stupid position? How exactly I can, I can check that? Hmm. Hmm. Is there like a list of villagers I have? Uh, builders? I don't think so. Villager professions? Town info. Can I have a full list of my villagers, please? To find a villager with basic education. <laughs> oh, God damn it! Edu we got 9% educated people, so somebody here needs to be educated. Education basic. Okay, you are an educated person. So you won't be working over here. Goodbye. Ah, there we go. Transfer successful. Now, just put anybody over here, that doesn't matter. Uh, but we have an educated teacher. Right, so he, he is capable of counting to, to five. And he's capable capable of putting uh, not one, but two logs into his into his pocket. So that's, 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 that's like the job description fulfilled. Uh, and he is now responsible for teaching the entirety of the stupidity of the of our community. Why the fuck I've lost so much food? Uh, we really need to start to make some barrels around here. There's like a specific building that makes barrels, but I, I need iron for this. I've sent scouts around and we haven't found any iron. There is no iron around this, this map. Found sand though, but I don't see any iron. Clay, okay. Deer, no problemo. Oh, willow bush. Willow bush? And a bunch of it as well. Holy shit, so send somebody over here, please. It's gonna be helpful. New day, a new trade has arrived. Even my own wagon started to work. Uh, I'm building like a new structure over this. We're gonna find out will that actually be beneficial for the for the village. Okay, please tell me that any of you want to buy my, you want to buy shoes. Okay, you want to buy planks. Okay, well the price is not so good. But what about the other one? Ugh, your price is even worse. Uh, what else we could try to make money on? You are selling stuff, but you're selling stuff of a price. Expect of you. You're selling tools for 24. Okay. Okay. I can I can make something out of this. I can sell to this. Uh, I can sell to this uh, trader 220 20 planks, and he's gonna pay me almost entirety of his money. So yeah, sell that thing. Oh yeah, we're making money right now. Uh, okay, you also want to buy shoes. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, what about you? You buy something interesting? Well, you buy baskets for reduced price, so that's something. to think. I want to buy tools from you. That's a lot of money. Hmm, that's a lot of money. But I think it's gonna be worth it in the end. Even if I'm gonna sell it for a normal price, I'm, I'm gonna make a profit out of this. Uh, so yeah, buy and stock. Don't don't put it in the warehouse. 
Okay, is there anything else we could try to make money out of you? I don't think so. Trader number one. No, oh, nothing interesting here. I could buy flour from you, I guess. Oh, you sell bricks as well. Huh. That could be good. Okay, I'm gonna buy flour from you. Uh, I only have 800, but we can make some money back if I'm gonna do something like this. Okay, buy and stock. Okay, sell him the shoes. For like 800. <laughs> This is gonna require a few clicking here and there. Uh, buy, buy more grain from you. More, more flour. Buy in stock. Okay, sell him, sell him now the rest of the shoes. <laughs> That's how you make profit, boys. And in the end, I've managed to buy 50 bricks out of him. And those bricks are gonna be essential because with them, I can upgrade my my market. I just need to stock pass some money. Wait, I think I have. Ah, I'm missing like a few coins. Okay, transfer the gold back to the to the main treasury. Uh, global storage. There we go. Okay, we just need 30 planks. And I can upgrade my market. Which should give me more cash. Finally, a good trader with a good deal just for me. He is buying planks. For a maximum price. Yay. Uh, what else are you buying? What are you, what are you selling? Everything. Uh Oh, you you got iron for a very good price. Okay, we can we can roll with that. Uh I'm trying to make some soap over here, but uh, this is this is going to take some time. Actually, I'm making one soap per sorry, five soap per five tallow and per one herb. So, if I could figure out how to make my, get myself a limited amount of tallow, I could make quite the buck on 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 soaps as well. I basically ordered my guys to make some uh, uh, some uh, some soap because my villagers were constantly dying out of sicknesses and illnesses. Uh, right now we got foot wound. Okay, you don't have shoes apparently. How how come you don't have enough shoes? You have some shoes around and broken legs. Hmm. Okay, no idea how that how the heck I'm supposed to fix that thing. I still got problems with flax, but till those fields won't get to their maximum fertility, I don't want to get any flax. Uh, but yeah, once they do, we're gonna focus those two fields on making flax, and that means that the tailor should then have a lots of work to do. If I'll if I'll for example uh, tell them right now to plant flax, right? How much I'm gonna get? Eight hundred. So that's eighty four. Uh, clothing out of this Pretty nice pretty nice indeed and because all of the resources I have I've actually managed to upgrade my Fletcher and now he can, he can create work uh, crossbows out of two planks and some iron Okay Hold on ah fuck the trader ah the trader just left god damn it, but yeah, I've I've managed to buy some iron I got 20, 123 iron. And the crossbow sells... I don't remember the price for the crossbows, but... I think we could try to make some money. Okay, transfer the transfer the, the iron, because I've bought it like so so bloody, uh, bloody cheap. And we're gonna make some crossbows. A trader that wants to buy crossbow has arrived. He's paying 54 per crossbow. Sadly, for some reason to me, the hunters decided to take the crossbows for hunting, so... Uh, yeah, I will try to transfer some of the crossbows to the to the storehouse and maybe I'll be able to sell them uh, later on But the investment is worth it The, the investment is worth a lot Th This is actually worth it and to make things even more interesting for example this trader sells uh, flour for two gold <laughs> and the other one buys them for free <laughs> Yo, <laughs> would you like to make some money? <laughs> 3,000? Yes, please. And I think at the very end, ladies and gentlemen, uh, just so you know, I got 3,000 in the storage over here. And this guy is selling... Uh, not this guy, I think. This guy is selling cows. So cows can give you leather. They can give you meat. So yeah, buy and stock them for now. I've already ordered my guys to build uh, a barn over here. Uh, I can sell you now, I think, the remaining of flour because I won't be able to do with this shit any anything uh, at the very moment. So sell all we have. All I have, actually. 
Uh, okay, so anything else we could try to sell to you at the very moment? Uh, not really. And what about you? Ah, you are buy you are buying this shit. Oh yes, oh yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Another two thousand. Thank you very much, Mr. Trader. Making business with you is such a pleasure. Uh, you want to buy baskets, but I don't care about that thing. Uh, I've bought locks for you from you because I'm cheesing the game, right? I'm planting the the trees for like one coin. I'm guessing the developers eventually are gonna fix this thing. So time to start to play Lego. Um, uh, okay. Right, it's progressing. In the small investment I have made some time ago, 4,000 remains in the trading post, 3,000 gets transferred to the to the city's treasury. And once those trees, actually, no, I screw it. Let's get uh, decorations. I wanted to make a big park over here. 500. From the current, from the, my current standpoint, 500 of gold for a park? No problemo. I can afford it. Just as I can afford them many other things right now in the in the village. So yeah, I'll, I call this thing, ladies and gentlemen, a complete success. And I'm also gonna want to make like a shrine over here. Yeah, of course, it's too big. Right. So the Fletcher is now currently making uh, lots of crossbows. I could not transfer any crossbows to the trade uh, to the traders uh, trading post because the game would allow me to trade anything till actually gonna have the item in the storage, unless a motherfucking trader were alive. That actually wants to buy that item, then you can transfer it without much of a problem. So yeah, currently uh, all of the items of the crossbows that I will produce will be transferred to the uh, to the trading post. Now I just have to wait for a trader to show up with some bricks. That pathetic 23 gold that the market is making is laughable at this point. As it is, ladies and gentlemen, we've made a bunch of gold. We've uh, traded the bunch of gold and, well, we are still progressing. I've got myself cattle. Uh, I had six. I, right now I got two, uh, I got eight. So I'm getting two per year, which is, which is very nice. Uh, so yeah, that's like, was, that was like 400 per cow, per cattle. Uh, we've built a gigantic uh, park over here, which was uh, 500 of, of gold as well. Uh, we have, I think, stable trading resources done. Uh, I've got like a bunch of items in the in the trading post for trading still. Uh, so we can trade with that thing. I got lots of soap. I'm making sure lots of soap. And as soon as the cattle actually is gonna be like too, too much, then the villagers will try to like you know control the population that thing is gonna give me more tallow which I can turn into more uh, more soap those two fields over here are now finally working uh, they are providing me with shitloads of, of, of flex which is going into the tailor which provides me in return with shitloads of uh, linen clothing so yeah you could say that this is progressing the market has 86 gold but that's okay uh, because we have like a bunch of money in in actual uh, items so oh Livestock animal born. How much? Mm, the game is not telling me. Ah, we only got one. Ah, that sucks. But okay, the the herd is slowly uh, growing, which is completely fine. Just just let it you know let it let it grow in peace. Like that's a, that's an investment. An investment that sooner or later uh, is gonna is gonna return. So right now the only issue I have left is basically problems with food. Like the food is constantly getting, getting spoiled. So that means I'm losing money, I'm losing resources, which is not acceptable. But I think I need to get battles. To get battles, we need iron. Thankfully, I got a bunch of battles. Uh, I got a bunch of iron because I'm putting those the, that iron uh, to be crafted into crossbows, which I'm already making a bunch. I think we got yeah, we got 81 crossbows, so that's like 42 gold piece per per crossbow. So yeah, you see where I'm going with this shit. Even though I haven't upgraded the market, I am making. Lots and lots of gold and oh, for example, this is nice. Uh, he wants to buy shoes 18 uh, 18 gold per piece. Sure. <laughs> Why not? Uh, what else you want to buy? You want to buy any clothing? Yeah, probably. So yeah, we'll see how this is gonna go. If you want to try this out some game yourself, ladies and gentlemen, link in the description below as always. The and if you excuse me, I will just leave this episode as is over here because I've already extended my record term. Five beyond my limit, so yeah, I'll just leave this thing as over here. Next episode, uh, we're gonna do some farming, but that's gonna be the thing for the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the flag episode. See you a lot. See you in the next video.